see me? <laughs> you ever have one of those days where you're just trying to do stuff? You're just you're just trying to do your day and nothing is going right. That's all right because it's Saturday and I don't have any deadlines. So we're not in the Jeep. Um, Shane took off with my Jeep this morning. He had to work. So, you guys have never been in this car with me, but it is a little car that Shane bought, I don't know, I think it's been a month or two ago, and um, it's a little, ooh, it's a little, uh, it's an Alero, I think is what it is, and um, so he took the Jeep this morning, so my choices were I could take the Alero, which is what I'm in, or I could take the Expedition, which is his big giant truck. And I would have been fine taking either one, but I got in the Expedition this morning, and that's his work truck, and it was gross. I love you, honey, but it was gross. Like, and there's gas cans in there, and lawn equipment, and it's just, it was all greasied up and manned out, and I was like, I'm not taking the Expedition. And that leaves the Alero, so... Um, the Alero is the little car that Shane was in when he did his um, Dollar Tree haul. <laughs> um, it's a great little car. This is really my first time to get in it and put her around. Um, it's just a little get around car. He paid cash for it. Um, but it's nice to have because um, Wyatt doesn't have a car right now. He's got a car, but it's at its dad's house and it needs a little bit of work. And uh, so Wyatt can just jump in this little thing anytime he wants. And Dalton is going to be getting his license in the next six months. So he can practice in it. And it's just paid for. And it's a little get around car. And I really enjoyed it today. But anyway, when I got in it, it was also dirty and gross from his trip to Dallas. And I was like, I can't go anywhere until I clean out a car. So I chose to clean out the Alero instead of the Expedition. So anyway, that's where we are today. And I went shopping. I was like, oh, I'm going to, you know, get around and I'm going to go to Dollar Tree because I was watching Coupon and Girl and she hauled all this cool stuff. And then I need to go to Walmart and I need to buy a new phone mount, which is what you guys are on because mine went kaput. And I need to do this and I need to get that. And I, I don't even really need to. I just wanted to. And, um... That also turned out to kind of be a bust. I mean, I got some stuff at the Dollar Tree. I got a few cool things, and I got what I needed at Walmart, but... And now this video is really dark, but it is what it is. So, <laughs> let's get into it. Um, I'm going to eat because um, we're working on 17 hours of fasting, and I'm hungry. So, I swung by... And this is not the healthiest choice, but it is Saturday. I'm not at home um, to eat my own groceries. And um, Shane and I are going out tonight, so I'll probably get a big fat salad tonight. But I did get some green beans. Oh, I went to Long John Silver's. And uh, I've always loved Long John Silver's my whole life. Love it. And... I didn't get much. I just got a side of green beans and I got a Baja fish taco. Tyler, this is probably right up your alley. Um, but I got a Baja fish taco for the first time, uh, I don't know, several months ago. It might have been even last fall. But it's a, it's a taco with coleslaw on it and Baja sauce and fish. And, well, they're just really, really good. I know that the crispy fish is not good for me, but I don't care. Right now, I don't care. Long John Silver's has good fish. Like, you have your fish filet from McDonald's. which is the bomb. But then you also have Long John Silver's fish. Mmm. 
I feel so low down to the ground. <laughs> like, in this car, I feel like I'm sitting on the ground. It's so funny. You know, because in the Jeep, you're higher up. You know, it's a nice change. And, let's talk about the Jeep for a second, because that's where you guys know me from, is my Jeep. Well, I don't know if you guys, I don't know if I've told you this or not, but we've been leasing the Jeep. We don't own the Jeep. We lease it. Um, our lease is up. We've been leasing it for three years. And our lease is up in August. So we're trying to decide, and we've been paying on it for three years. So at the end of your lease, you have the option to trade this that Jeep in and get another vehicle. That's what usually having a lease is about, is that it keeps you in a new car. Um, so at the end of the lease, we will either go ahead and buy the Jeep and just pay the last two years on it, or... Um, We'll give it back, and I will go buy something else. I want something smaller. My son, Alex, just bought... We went down and bought him. He bought it, but I helped him. He's paying for it, but he went down and got a Chevy Sonic, a little four-door Chevy Sonic, and it's black, and it is the cutest, zippiest little car. Every time I go to work in the morning, I see Alex's little car sitting there, and I'm like, God, I want that little car. I want that little car. So, when we turn the Jeep in, if we decide not to buy it, and if we decide to give it back, I'm not going to trade it in for anything. I'm not going to trade it in for a newer Jeep or a newer car. Um, I'm either going to keep the Jeep or I'm going to give it back and get something else at a different car place. So, I would not mind having a little Chevy Sonic like my son's. It's zippy. It's small. It's perfect for me. I drive a lot. And so, I would love to have a gas saver. I need something like my Honda. I don't know if y'all remember, but... I used to have a little Honda. My favorite car. I miss that car. But Hondas are kind of pricey, so I'll either keep the Jeep or I'll go buy something small. Small and zippy with half the car payment. Alex's little car payment's only $234. That's it. I could totally handle that. The Jeep is double that. And I wouldn't mind cutting that in half. This is really, really good. So, I'll upload this video. Just a mukbang talking about cars. And then when I get home, I'll do my Dollar Tree haul in a different video. So y'all get a double feature today. Like my hair. It was the second day hair. Damn. I did manage to put some makeup on. It's so dark in here. I wonder if um, I wonder if I'll be able to fix that. These green beans are really good. They have a lot of flavor. Oh, you know what I made the other night? I made them and they were gone. I made two huge pans of them and they were gone. You know slider sandwiches? You can make all different kinds of sliders. Well, I made breakfast sliders. So what I did is I bought two pounds of sausage, you know, like Jimmy Dean. I bought two of those. And I um, browned that up in the skillet. And then I got the Hawaiian sweet rolls, two deals of them. Because remember, you guys, I have six people in my house that I have to feed. So I bought two packages of Hawaiian sweet rolls. 
um, one package for each pan. And I cut them in half. I put that brown sausage on there. I scrambled up some eggs in another skillet. So once the eggs were done and the sausage were done, um, I put the sausage on there, I put the eggs on there, and then I put some shredded cheese on there. I put that slider top back on there, put those bad boys in the oven. Breakfast sliders, y'all. They were so good. So stinking good. I always make all kinds of stuff and I never video it. I should start videoing it. I have made a little, I have a post-it app on my phone and I've started making a list of videos that I want to make because I'll forget. If I don't write things down, I will forget. So, anyway, I'm going to jump off here. I'm going to finish my sandwich, fish, taco, what have you, and um, I will see you guys in my Dollar Tree haul. I love you. The Lord loves you more, and we will see you in a bit.